Bonjour mes amis, hi guys, this is the Hydroflex, the beautiful brand new strap by Artem. Uh, Artem, we know them well for their sailcloth type of straps which I have reviewed on the channel. This is the brand new product and I love it. Uh, it is a hybrid construction uh, with a premium FKM rubber base and an embossed synthetic material uh, with a sailcloth pattern upper layer they have sent me uh, three colors to try and for now the strap is only available uh, with a uh, lug width of 20 millimeters tapering down to 18 the thickness tapers from uh, 5.3 millimeters at the lug end down to uh, 2.55 millimeters uh, which looks really great uh, you'll see on the different watches that i will try these on the Hydroflex comes uh, fitted with a premium quick release spring bars, so it's a breeze to switch them up. So the straps are water and dust resistant. And first, let's try the blue one with the black uh, stitching on uh, my Zin U50. And you will see uh, later on, I will try the straps on a dressier timepiece. Uh, you can go on the website. The link is in the description Four different colors. There's also a green available, very uh, trendy. And yes, if you have a black watch like my Zin, you can ask for the PVD coated buckle. And if you love deploy on buckles, they're available as well for an extra charge uh, 218 us dollar is the price for these uh, uh, straps and when you see the quality of the construction i think it is uh, really all uh, worth it now let's check it out uh, on uh, my garrick s5 uh, dressier timepiece uh, fully handmade in the uk let's see first i think uh, the gray strap uh, with the black accent will work perfectly with the chaptering and uh, the uh, the details of the watch indeed on the wrist uh, as you can see the Artem straps I find work really well also with dressier timepieces and uh, actually this timepiece is 100 meters of uh, water resistance so there you go you can jump in the pool uh, safely uh, with your strap and your watch uh, the blue works really well as well with the uh, the blue the hands of uh, the watch and i like to break up the colors as well and the black gets it a bit more uh, dressy and it looks uh, excellent as well and why not something in between uh, chronograph a bit on the uh, dressy side this is my zenit el primero which color do you prefer i think the blue uh, once again is gonna be the the winner here it marries quite well with the uh, moon phase very nice and the buckle very elegant as well if you have a nice watch i think the buckle has to uh, match the, the quality of the the case and uh, this buckle here has nice bevels on the side one of the nicest buckles that i have seen often a let down with other strap companies yeah on the wrist uh, i think uh, this is a, a smash and i like that uh, the strap at uh, five point three millimeters of a thickness at the at the lugs marries well with uh, the rounded cases that i have uh, tried uh, tried it on now the measurements uh, only uh, one size available the short portion is about 75 millimeter the long portion about 11.5 and from the end to the last hole, about 60, the last hole to the lugs, about uh, 50 uh, millimeters. Uh, comparing to the sailcloth strap, it is uh, flatter at the top, while the uh, classic uh, sailcloth strap that we reviewed before showed a strong uh, embossed uh, shape uh, contrasting with the stitching. It was uh, a bit less uh, flexible, of course, it would uh, keep the size, uh, the shape of the wrist, if you will, at the top on the embossed part, uh, while uh, the uh, new Hydroflex is uh, very flexible all the way, as you can see, flatter at the top. And so slightly uh, different. Now, if you look at the, the bottom, the previous uh, sailcloth strap was 
all smooth as you can see while the new Hydroflex has a pattern all along and a long groove uh, for the stitching so quite a bit more complex and offering a bit more air uh, for the, the wrist uh, to stay cool uh, in the summer. Uh, both uh, very nice, uh, the uh, silk strap very smooth while the Hydroflex uh, offers a bit re of resistance when you uh, rub it uh, with your finger. There you go, I think uh, quite a bit more complex in the uh, construction. Once again on the wrist with a bit more distance, uh, I like the thickness, it marries well uh, with all the watches that I tried it on and I've been playing around with my autumn straps, uh, with my Omega Seamaster uh, and all sorts of watches, my Tudors and they just work fantastic. So there you go, let me know and let the brand know what you think about this fantastic new product. It's not often that we get to uh, discover a new strap of great quality from a strap maker that we can trust, that we know is gonna uh, serve us well. So uh, looking forward to see this collection develop. And once again, I wanna thank uh, Artem Strap for trusting me to review their excellent product. And thank you guys for checking it out. Bye bye guys.